Hi everyone, this is Vikas. I welcome all of you in third video tutorial uh, for the Panda series. And here we would uh, see how to load CSV file. So basically it is uh, a comma separated value files and it is also a Excel file only but it has a extension of .csv. So today's our agenda is how to load csv file okay or csv data set so please don't confuse with file or data set because uh, it contains information right so which contains information and which we want to use that is that would be considered as a file or data set now first of all we have to import the pandas so what we'll write import pandas as pd okay once we execute then this uh, package is loaded then we will try to load the data set so in this case we have to write pd dot read underscore and earlier we have seen uh, for the excel file which has an extension I'll just write excel file has a extension of dot uh, xls or dot xlsx so we have we had used pd dot read underscore excel okay but in this case we should not use excel and we have to use dot csv okay so I'll just remove this and uh, thereafter we have to write the file name and of course we have to write the extension because this is a CSV file so extension will be CSV and then we execute this so now uh, we have to check the file name first and this is my file name which is annual enterprise survey 2019 financial right so see here it also shows this is a Microsoft Excel for housing underscore Excel for the earlier tutorial we have seen so uh, you can see both are Microsoft Excel file only but both uh, having different extension okay so now I'll select this annual enterprise survey right click and go for the properties you can also do the same thing and here you can just check this out this file has a very long name right it has a very long name so what we can do we can just copy from here itself okay we can just copy and see here Microsoft Excel comma separate value files and this is the extension part here uh, I'll try to increase the screen size okay so this is dot CSV so it has a dot CSV extension earlier which uh, data set we have loaded so that has an extension of dot xlsx but here we have dot csv so please make sure that while writing the extensions please don't forget to mention that dot csv okay now we'll go over here and in, in place of this file name we have to write the file name and we have given this dot csv hyphen csv also it is considered as the file name part only okay so don't worry for that but here we have to write this dot csv once we execute this it is executed now we'll just check that that this file has been loaded properly or not so we have to check the header and footer so how to check the header file header means the first five rows so data set dot head it shows year industry underscore aggregations nz sioc so this is this file pertained with the new zealand data set okay uh, which is talking about the financial year 2019 uh, for the enterprise survey annually so this data set pertained with new zealand that's the reason all details are available for the new zealand over here so now we didn't find any kind of discrepancy over here now again we'll just check the uh, tail also for that data set we have just given data set dot tail and once we have executed 
it shows the last five rows and in this case you can also find what is the dimension of this data set so dimension in the sense how many rows are there and how many columns are there so rows you can find it out using this which shows it has a total 32,444 rows okay and obviously it has started from zero so you can just increase by one which becomes 32,445 rows and how many columns are there you can just count from here one two three four five six seven eight and nine and ten so nine or ten columns are there so this is how we can uh, load the csv file and instead of this pd.read underscore excel we have to write pd.read underscore csv this is how we can load the csv file in jupyter notebook using python thank you so much and if you really appreciate this effort so please do hit on like button and please do subscribe our channel and please do uh, check other videos which is available